The House of Representatives on Tuesday summoned the Minister of Petroleum Resources and all relevant stakeholders in the petroleum industry to appear before the Green Chamber and brief Nigerians on the measures it has put in place to end the current fuel scarcity and avert its reoccurrence in the future. The move followed a motion of urgent public importance by Honorable Omar Ajilo on the need to address the lingering fuel scarcity and rising retail prices of premium motor spirit PMS across the country. The lawmaker also expressed concerns over the fuel scarcity as it is coming at a time when the subsidy removal is having adverse con economic effects on Nigerians and more worrisome that these economic quagmires have made the lives of average Nigerians unbearable with a litre of fuel selling as much as 1,200 naira in some states of the Federation. All these economies have made the lives of average Nigerians unbearable. The leader of foreign trade as much as 1,200 in some states of the Federation. The Speaker, my dear colleagues, let us not be most right in this occasion to ensure that large videos are making to address this unfortunate and unfortunate situation permanently in the French of the foreign trade. In another development, the House of Representatives also directed the Nigeria Electricity Regulatory Commission, NEC, to stop the introduction of the new electricity tariff for customers. This followed a motion of urgent national importance by Honorable Kama Nkem Kama <coughs> at the floor of the House. The mo this motion proposes resolution to suspend the tariff increases, establish a special committee for hearings involving relevant stakeholders, appoint a technical consultant to assess the legality and reasonableness of next procedures, and draft a bill to improve regulatory process in tariff setting. Overall, this motion underscored the importance of legislative action to address the challenges facing the electricity sector and ensure fair treatment of consumers while promoting transparency and accountability in regulatory decision making.